uh, was walking around Providence downtown, saw a 2009 Nissan Cube pull up to a stoplight, and I think the driver was John Stupid. Could I be mistaken? It's a Nissan a Cube. A Nissan Cube. It's only the best car on the road, Chris. It was John Stupid. I saw you. You were hitting the, uh, the crosswalk button. But I had a meeting to get to. It was um, on the other side of town. I was meeting a guy about the... Uh, Thinking about starting a new a new uh, Domino's business, D uh, checkers checkers Domino's, you know, something like a board game business. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, stuff's taking off. Arcade. I have a lot of businesses that I'm thinking about. Hot businesses right now: grandfather clock repair, limos, li a limousine service. Those are humongous. Axe throwing. Oh yeah, axe throwing. I mean, that stuff like it's nowhere, and everybody, you know, that stuff's gonna everybody's gonna love axe throwing for years and years and years to come. Period. <laughs> Period. Never gonna go out of style ever. I don't get those axe throwing. Do you like the? Everyone? No, I'm not into it. It's like beard oil. Shit. Yeah. No. Staven with the 25. Hey Nick, I'm 23, making 170k doing software in the Bay. Right now, lease. Right now, leasing a 21 Forester can buy it out for 17k. Is it dumb to buy a 35 to 40k car? Um, for example, GR86. Uh, 997 Porsche at my age or should I keep the Forester and ball out hard at 30? Uh, yeah, keep the Forester and ball out hard at 30. Um, 17 is a nice buyout for that. <clears throat> at the end of your lease, you know the car. Um, you'll just lose. The 997 is not that fast. Um, go to a couple of like autocross and like experiential driving stuff is getting more popular. Go drive a bunch of things first and figure out what you like and what you're going to want to do. Like, I thought I wanted to, like, track cars and shit. I don't have time to do that. It's really expensive, too, like, like outlandishly. Um, cars and coffee is whack as shit. I'm just being real. I don't know. Find out what you like doing around balling out cars before you go buy one. Because, like, I thought I wanted to be in, like, the cool, like, vintage Beamer scene. And then as soon as I stepped foot in, I wanted to kill myself. And I already had one. Yeah. I was, like, 10 grand into a car. And... I realized that I don't I don't want to be in this this group anymore. Yeah, I was in the worst. Yeah, I've never I've never uh, I don't even think I have many friends that own them. It'd be like buying like a weird guitar that only like weirdos play yeah. or something like I don't know yeah, like, yeah. like like lap steels or something yeah. like that. And you're like I don't want to hang out with the guys who play lap steels. I appreciate I, I appreciate you trying to parallel cars guitars. Stuff to guitar stuff. So like oh Chris, you know, I don't know what you'd spend a lot of money on. That's what I'm trying to guess what you'd spend too much. Like I, I, I like to ask that question to someone. That's a good. Uh, Good uh, iceberg. What is the what is something you spend a, dispropor a dispropor disproportionate yeah. amount of your money on? Uh, yeah, maybe maybe guitars or me any music gear. So I was wrong. No, <laughs> <laughs> you're like, dude, appreciate it. So I can yeah. kind of, I'm trying to work the abstract. You know what I mean? But I did. I fucking ruined it. I, yeah. I wanted to. Be, I wanted to. I bought an E3. I, I'm literally into the car for like ten thousand or ninety five to ten somewhere in that range, and I hate it. And like, I don't even, I'll wreck it. I'm going to crush it. You'll see. Uh, we got Jake Hen with the 25. Hey, Nick, big fan. Uh, I was in a car accident and totaled my 01 Subaru Legacy. What car would you recommend around the 12K mark with all-wheel drive or four-wheel drive? Uh, God bless and keep up the great work. Thanks, man. Be safe. Jesus Christ. I hope you're all right. Yeah. 01 yeah. Legacy. Wow. Um, 12 grand. All-wheel drive, 12 grand. Um, CRV. A pretty used one, uh, Lexus RX. A uh, pretty used one, 07, 0, 07 to 12 MDX, um, RDX. Same thing, Acura RDX, all-wheel drive. Um, uh, I would stay away from the Beamers. I would stay Japanese. Uh, Rav. Rav. Uh, all-wheel drive Element, Honda Element. I don't say that well enough. Uh, Toyota Tacoma older one real old one for 12 grand you're not gonna get a nice one uh chevy gmc gmc sierra crew cab a volkswagen atlas <laughs> you can get a volkswagen the, the volkswagen atlas chris has a sponsor sponsored by volkswagen yeah yeah we, uh, it's um volkswagen is paying them yeah the deal thousand a month to the dealers volkswagens the dealership it's they're all the all like the decor in there it's all about like 
we're different. Like the the, yeah. the, the peace and love. It's just it's. Funny. We're not the same kind of car company, except yeah. we do the exact same thing. Look, yeah. a, look, a sweaty pool playing looking guy that's gonna try to stuff you into a GTI. Uh, we got Drew Scott with the twenty five. Just picked up a eighty five F one fifty with the three hundred inline six in it for sixteen hundred. What do you think? Any advice for getting into flipping houses? P.S. Some Portuguese guy just. Pi- Put his dog in a claw machine trying to retrieve a Starbucks gift card. Because that's my uncle Pedro Stupid. I haven't, he was still doing the old claw dog trick, huh? Um, wow. Uh, yeah, the inline six, the six cylinder Ford, uh, 85 Fords. It's the urban cowboy truck. No. Um, and thank you, Kat, for gifting five memberships. And thank you for that. Damn. Um, no, the, that that body uh, Fords are okay. I like the uh, in the mid '80s. I actually like the, the '82 Power Wagons and uh, those Fords. I, I had a '71 Ford F100 four by four stick shift that uh, I bought in California. Then I had a '70 70 GMC Sierra uh, High Country High whatever the fuck it was. That one came out pretty cool. Um, they're they're all right. I like new trucks, man. I was talking about this with uh, Dear God. Dear God, yeah, yeah. Chatting with him. Yeah, yeah. He was we were talking about old trucks. I was like, honestly, man, I like like I like twenty one Denali twenty five hundreds. <laughs> like I like like new trucks. They're just so much. They're so much better because the old trucks are expensive now. Like like cool old trucks are big big bucks. So I don't I don't and they suck. They stink. The AC yeah. doesn't work. They ride like shit, like milk crate. Don't care at all about them. I'm talking about, I like, I like a 19 Chevy 1500 or a, that's like a Ram. I don't even give a shit. Just newer pickup trucks are so much better. <laughs> since Yuri with the 20, uh, in the market for an SUV since my XJ is going bye-bye. Uh, mid, mid, late nineties, four runners and pathfinders are around my area. Is there any SUVs you'd recommend for re- reliability, easy to maintain for a youngin? Oh, four, five, six, uh, Acura MDX is a God, is a God world car. Um, uh, the four I had a 90 the forerunners try to get as close to a 97 as you can the the early 90s are really really rot, uh, ratty um, uh, those are the best two I like the 0456 MDX a lot um, the 99 2001 2002 RX is a good one um, any of the GX Lexus any of the early Lexus SUVs are great Toyota Sequoias uh, early aughts Toyota Sequoias are good um yeah. Jordan Jacob with the 20. Hey, Nick, there's a 1982 Mercedes Benz 380 SL for sale. No. Near <laughs> near me in good condition for 8K. No, pass. You get the 560 for 8K. There you go. 9K. The, no one wants the three, the six cylinders. They're not bad. I like Mechatronics. Uh, Mech, look up Mechatronic. They do the SLs over. They're f- awesome. But uh, no one wants the six cylinders. They're not worth eight grand. Um, they're, they're, and they're losing. They suck. Yeah. Only, and, oh, they only want the 560. The, the 380 doesn't sell. The 380s could be four grand. I wouldn't buy one. And it's an 82. You want an 87. You want like later in the year. You want like, you want if even if you wanted a six, you'd want the the latter ones. The 87, 88, 89s, 90 even. Yeah, the 82 is like a rough year. 78, 82, 84 is old, old, rough. We got a Creme Collective with 10, 11 Canadian. Uh, hey Nick, thinking of getting a mid 2000s Lexus IS. I heard the 350 is the only way because the 250 is fuel injected in a lemon engine. Also, should I go for it or get a newer Toyota? No, those are those are pretty good. Those IS, those Lexus ISs are nice pieces. Go for a 12 or a 14. You get a better if you want to finance it. Yeah. You're going to be paying. You're going to be paying six, seven, eight grand for about 10, 12. I think your ease of getting into a smaller loan on a real if you can scout out a nice 10, 10, 11 thousand dollar car with a that's financeable from a decent, reputable Lexus dealership that just doesn't appreciate old cars yeah. and take a shit rate. That's a little bit better way of go to doing that than dumping about eight grand in cash. It's a fully out of warranty, out of service car. IS stands for instant savings. That's right. That's right. It does. Um, uh, Ishi G D D T with the twenty five. Hey Nick, been a fan since. Parking lot genie, Dang. my ninety nine super my ninety nine super duty I bought when I was sixteen just hit four hundred and seventy five on the original five point four and four R one hundred. I'm uh, I'm twenty five now. How long do I have to be a rich guy before I can buy a new pl- uh, platinum? 
and you were already a rich guy. Are you kidding me? You're in. A, are you in a two valve? You're in the two valve five four. Good for you, bro. You keep driving that thing. That truck looks no different, man. They don't look since ninety. I love the ninety, like ninety ninety seven and on ninety eight when they started with that bike. I've been obsessed with the Subaru. I had I had an 07. I had an 04, an 07. Now I have a twenty two. I love them, man. Uh, stay, keep with it, buddy. Buddy, drive that thing forever and ever and ever. I just bought Nick. I was in the car business. I had to do it. You do stupid things when you're in the car business. But I do. I got, I'm not gonna lie. I do love my truck. Trucks are the sh like new diesel trucks. Pretty safe bet on the money wise. And then, um, but you're 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 beating the system right now, man. I just gotta go back to this MILF courthouse. But thank you. Congratulations on on making. Uh, I mean, four hundred thousand miles, dude. You, God, you're, you're traveling the world in that thing. Truck's been good to you. You guys got good. You guys got a good relationship. Your truck cares about you.